I would drag my balls across a thousand miles of broken glass just to sniff the chair that you've been sitting on. Oh my god! You make me so horny I could throw myself in a wood chipper right now. Bruh. Our genitals can make music. Let me show you. If there was a challenge of how many women you could actually get to respond to what you say, loser. If you didn't win or pass that challenge, loser. You don't get into heaven. Oh, Why? You already know the topic that we're going to be on today. We're going to be reading them thirsty DMs. We're going to be exposing. I mean, I'm going to block the names out. Of course, I'm not I'm not that bro, though. But it gets crazy. Now, not all of them are thirsty. Some of them are funny. And I just couldn't help but to laugh. So, no long intro today. Let's get straight into it. We have the person who is always suggesting they like to bump genitals. Clearly, that is just not how you go about approaching someone. He says, can we be friends with benefits if I come back to Ohio? Hit me up. Come on. You are literally 72. You have no morals. You're insecure. Where's your dignity? Where is the dignity? It's probably two feet in the grave right along with you and your dusty Kango hat. A Kango hat from the 90s. Somebody wants to show me the what the fuck is it? What the fuck are those? Who's still wearing that? Besides Samuel Jackson. He's the only person who can wear a Kango hat and get away with it. You, sir, my friend on the other end. No. Go lie down in your grave. Please go lie down in your grave. I um, refuse to take anybody serious who's wearing a Kangol hat. I'm sorry, I just can't do that. I don't care who you are. I mean, unless you're Samuel L. Jackson, and that's about it. Like I said before, he is the only person that's allowed to wear the Kangol hats and that actually nobody talks about because it's Samuel L. Jackson. And then we have the motivated self-talkers. They, they don't give up. They're relentless. They can carry a conversation on with themselves for years, not have an issue with it, not at all. And those are the ones I think should honestly be um, funded by the government because at that point, you might need a disability check or a mental check just for the simple fact that, I mean, you're talking to yourself, no progress has been made. And to be honest, I just don't think it's fair to the rest of the society out here that there's people like you on the run. You're not getting like, I don't know, compensated for it. Cause this is a lot of hard work. So you should be compensated for your mental illness. Girl, where you at? Do that shit then. I should be there with you. No, you shouldn't. Two thumbs up, winky eye. Two more thumbs up. I mean... What the fuck?! Pure... Persistence. Pure persistence. Um, you, you don't get a reward from me, but you are persistent. And I know for damn you can probably hold a job down. If you can't, you, you got it. Your priorities are wrong, brother. All wrong. Another self-talker. Hello. 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 Just stop. Please just stop. We have the person that loves to sexually harass us. First, he sends an emoji with the money face, the tongue, you know, money out, whatever. Then he says, is it fat? Nope. That literally gives me the chills. Is it fat? That's your approach? You, I've never talked to you. Is it fat? What if I said, it's skinny and it's stank? Then what? It's skinny and it's stank. I don't even know.
know how to explain this type of person but they try to work their way in by acting timid and shy i guess so this person says i want to ask you a question but i'm low-key scared to lane shot don't ask then don't ask I don't care about what you're going through. Do not ask me the question. Don't ask me anything, matter of fact. And I'm glad he read the message and didn't respond. He did exactly as I said, don't ask then. You gotta love your broken English foreigners. They're always there. They're always gonna be there. They're never ever going anywhere. This guy's from India. Wow, that car is loud in the background. This guy is from India and apparently I accepted his friend request. So his first message, thanks for your confirm. Broken English as hell, I already know. Hello, how are you? You more sexy and beautiful. Thumbs up. Didn't respond. Let me tell you a funny story about this one. I didn't even know this message was in my messages until I actually like went through and searched and i seen that i never even opened it because i never even got a notification this must have been one of the ones that was in the like the spam section of your messages then he proceeds to go bipolar on me are you coward hey what happened your pussy so decay <laughs> like your ass oh. <laughs> hold up sir hold up are you telling me i'm rotten are you telling me I'm dying? I'm some rodent on the ground? <laughs> Am I a squirrel or something? What? Okay. <laughs> then he goes on again. <laughs> About an hour later, he's still heated. <laughs> From 925 to 1039. Oh. You're always bad forever. Ever. <laughs> I mean your ass and your pussy. It's easy. Why is he going in on me like this? I never even did nothing to this man. I never knew the messages were there. And then he comes again in July and he res he says something. I don't even know what that word is. Maybe it's an Indian word. I don't know. But these are the people that are nice for one second and you don't give them what they want and then they turn around and go stone cold Steve Austin on you. <laughs> Those are the ones that'll kill you. You better watch out. Another foreigner. Please, can I see your boobs without bra? Please, please, love it. <laughs> I need money, please, please. Yeah, I give you money. Show me your tits. Give me money first. Show me your tits first. Can you suck my I just want to know, how would I do that anyway? You're somewhere in India. I, you want a virtual? A virtual BJ? Yeah. Go ahead and, go ahead and uh, send it on over. I got gotcha. you. Another talker, and this talker is actually asking me to marry them. Are you single? Will you marry me one day, Joy? I want you. Good morning, beautiful. Marry me. I could be the world's most notorious serial killer in hiding right now. And you would never know. Sometimes you guys invite yourself into murder. Because being this thirsty is going to get you there. You should never be this thirsty. Just think about all the women that are possible serial killers. Because if I was a, a serial killer, I would murder all the thirsty victims that came my way. I would murder every single last one of you if that was my MO, if I like to kill people. Disclaimer, I am not a killer. But if I was, easy target. Easy target to get for me to get my rocks off. Like, come on. You guys gotta do better.
this message isn't really too crazy like the whole thread is not crazy or anything like that but i still never responded what i want to focus on is the comment of afro thunder Let, let's look at the afro thunder part of things don't call me that <laughs> don't call me afro thunder that's a character like a male character on a boxing game at that just don't call me afro thunder I don't know if you thought that was a compliment, but it's not. You're calling me a man. Do not. <laughs> Ooh, just don't do it. <laughs> so this last one, it's not really, it's not really anything that they can be blasted for, but it's a profile picture alone that makes it hella weird. I honestly feel like their eye is representing, representing, represent, oh my gosh, representing them watching me through the little tiny lens of my computer. He's the government. He's the creep. I bet he's on the dark web right now watching me make this video. I don't like it. I don't like that picture. And then on top of it, you forwarded something about God. That don't that don't get that don't get my conversation gears going, bruh. That's just not gonna work for me. Um, I believe and I believe by myself. I do not talk to nobody about what I believe in or who I believe in. I I just keep all that to myself and I know I just do what's right to people, for people, and that's that. But talking about God is not a conversation starter for me. Another lose, another lose, lose. If you guys like my content, just make sure you give me a like, a thumbs up, do something, subscribe, share, comment, whatever. But that is it. I wrap up for that today and I will be back again. So you guys have a splendid night.